of rain at the property. And the bugs are out, that's for sure. But it's time to get to work. I've got 850 meters of wild shrubbery, bushes, trees, and thick brush to clear. This part of the trail is actually the most difficult to clear. It's real soupy in here, so I've had to throw on my rain boots just to keep my feet dry. It's not gonna be any easy task, but nobody said it would be. Blood, sweat, and tears, as they say. Hopefully no blood, and most likely no tears. But lots and lots of sweat I'm going to have to put in a lot of hard work. But once this trail is cleared, everything's going to be great. So this is the end of the road here. I have a marker on that tree down there. The big tall conifer pines. I have to follow my own marks out. So I've spent the last half an hour marking the trees of this area. I don't have to cut anything down because it's quite uh, open. I've just marked the tree. All I've got to do is find my marks out of here. It's fairly open, it's dry. Here's another mark you can see. I know that I'm heading that way at a bearing of about 255 degrees west. So I just would reverse it if I couldn't find my way out, but I see all my markers. There's a marker coming up. The mosquitoes are bad. It's hotter today, it's 26 degrees. Now there's a breeze coming through, which feels nice. <laughs> Love these markers. Here's another marker. I'm gonna find my way out of here, show you what the terrain looks like.
after a long day at the office, I like to relax, wash up, and cool off. Man, that water feels great. It's a good thing I found this swimming hole. Got the whole place to myself. If you like these videos, please subscribe, and I'll see you next time.